Each cockpit crew member is provided with one oxygen mask, which is installed in a stowage box and located adjacent to each crew member's seat. Indications of the oxygen system status is displayed on the lower ECAM on the door OXY page. The system OFF is indicated by the amber regular low pressure message and amber color of the OXY high pressure. The system ON is recognized when the regular low pressure message disappears and oxy pressure is displayed green. Testing of the mask for oxygen flow and communication capabilities is possible while the mask is in the stowage box. Prior to testing, the pilot must push the crew supply button on the oxygen overhead panel Select the loudspeaker volume knob to the 2 o'clock position. Press and adjust the int reception knob. Put the int rad switch into the int position. Now the testing procedure can start. Press the test reset button. The blinker flow meter turns yellow for a short time which indicates that momentary flow of oxygen has been released. The on-demand system is tested by pressing the emergency pressure selector knob and, at the same time, the test and reset button. The blinker again turns yellow and remains yellow as long as the knob is pressed. When these tests are completed, check that the test and reset button returns to the up position. Put the N100% selector in the 100% position. In case of excessive cabin altitude or rapid decompression, the ECAM displays automatically the cab press page. The checklist to be followed by the pilots is displayed on the upper ECAM memo. To remove the mask from the stowage, squeeze the red grips and pull the mask upwards. Keeping the red grips squeezed causes the oxygen flow to inflate the head harness so it can be pulled over the head. Releasing the grips stops the oxygen flow to the harness and the mask fits tight to the face. The oxygen mask is designed to be donned with one hand, fit over normal eyewear, transfer the microphone automatically to the mask once removed from the stowage box. The mask regulator provides either a mixture of ambient air and oxygen or pure oxygen by means of the N, normal, 100% selector. Airbus industry procedure calls for setting the selector always in the 100% position. When the emergency pressure knob is rotated, the mask then is supplied with overpressure permanent flow of oxygen. To take the mask off, squeeze the red grips and take the mask off. Place the mask on the side console and close the doors of the stowage box. Press the test and reset button to shut off the oxygen flow.